Welcome to my first movie about Picatren battery trains. These are made in Spain and are powered by two D cells and a three volt motor. I start at the beginning by switching the motor on with the switch right at the front. Here you see one of my two trains running around a combined oval. Combined from the track from two sets. One set is the Altera, which uses Talgo type coaches, and the other set is sort of a general purpose express in orange, and that has four wheel coaches. Now, the most interesting aspect from a collecting point of view of Peter Trend is that the locos and the running stock are actually printed thin plates. The local, you, they obviously use plastic under parts and plastic wheels, but the main bodies are printed tin plates. Now you can see the express train running. These sets come with a loco and a light, which gives them a bit of sort of extra flavour. The, the coaches tend to resemble more the old the class 114 that have just gone off from. UK Railway. I've now changed the layout because with two sets you tend to get quite a surplus of curves. So by rearrangement I've actually included a sort of extra section with extra curves. Now if you look carefully you can see that this train, the white Talgo, is moving quite well through the double curves where one goes left and then right. This is actually one of the benefits of Talgo system, which was invented in Spain, for use on their curved track. The system still exists, they still use it today, and they have to export it around the world, including, I believe, the United States. But you can actually see the benefits of it here, especially when it's sort of compared with the default four-wheel system that runs on this railway. Now this is another variation of the layout, a sign two or three. In the centre are the two station buildings, one of which comes with each set, and a set of people and in fact the cars printed onto flat. While the people are different between the sets, the um, poses they make are the same. So I get you get two post office vans, one but they're different vans from each set. I think it's more to do with the age of the sets, one is earlier than the other. As you can see, this cargo runs nice and smooth, but we will be moving on to the standard default electric railway, which uses the orange loco and the orange coaches in a minute, and you'll see there's quite a, a difference in how they run through double curves. Notice how they just about stay on the track. And in fact, you're seeing sort of edited ed video because it's about 50-50 whether they do. We also slow down a bit at some of the curves because of the squeeze going through. Finally, it is actually plateway, not railway. It's wheels running inside an L-shaped track. Thank you for watching.